a Colt Diamondback at <laughs> Check JW here. Uh, what a beautiful revolver that is. Uh, a very used revolver. Uh, I do def definitely take this one out, fire it every now and then, uh, especially when I first got it. Uh, it's been in the collection for a while, and uh, you know what? I figure I'd bring out the old uh, cleaning block, the old rustic, rugged, flawed cleaning block uh, to kind of resemble this pistol. It's uh, it's definitely flawed, uh, and that's the one thing is uh, with a lot of my stuff, um, it's not so much that oh it's worth all this money or anything like that. It's a lot of it's a cool factor for me. It's just uh, it's the. Uh, that wow you know it's got all this history it's it's really cool and that's usually it uh, so i really don't care if something you know maybe have got a mark on it or something like that or or perhaps uh, somebody had uh, modified it and it might not be worth as much money i, I really don't that's not really my game um, I bought this and I have this because of the I brought the tape out here Brannigan John Wayne yeah uh, in that movie, uh, he plays a, uh, a Chicago police officer and travels to London. And <laughs> the infamous scene from, I, I love the scene with Richard Attenborough. And he says, uh, Lieutenant, you shouldn't be wearing that particular item. And he says, oh, the, front, the guy in the front door said I had to. And he says, we're not talking about your tie. We're talking about that Colt 38 caliber Diamondback you have here. And uh, that's what he's talking about right there. Uh, it's certainly a, a gorgeous revolver without a doubt and so I found this on a gun broker years back many years ago and I remember seeing the price was really really low I think it was like six hundred dollars or something like that um, and it one thing is it had these original grips and these original Colt grips were very um, very expensive it has a little crack in it, which I didn't care. I mean, it, it was, it's been glued, so uh, I really didn't care about that. Yeah, I guess you could go on eBay and buy a brand new set and it would cost you an arm and a leg, but it had some spotting. Uh, the fella said it's, it's definitely been used. Uh, I didn't care about all that. Uh, he, I wanted to shoot her anyway because I knew I was going to be, I want to take this to the range and be like John Wayne and, and Brand again. But no, I, I said, you know what? With that kind of price, uh, and I, I called them over the phone. It wound up being a, uh, a shop out in uh, Seattle, Washington. They, they wound up, it actually wound up being like a, a gun shop or a, a slash gun range, something like that. Uh, so I purchased this from them. And this actually came from the fellow's personal collection. And I, I asked him over the phone, I said, uh, does it lock up good? Does it lock up tight? And he says, yeah, and you know, I mean, everything is solid on it. Uh, it's mechanically sound works really well it does have that typical colt uh, double action pull I, I will let you know a little right now i'm a smith and wesson guy i really like those but uh you know this is not bad uh so i, I take it out to the range used to take it out a lot uh, it's been kind of hiding tucked away in the safe a lot more uh, but there it is and that's a little story behind it and everything and of course uh, i only pretty much kept it because john wayne in that movie it's uh, really cool to me i actually like this one better than the python i know it's kind of crazy Oop, bump the camera here but you can see that the hammer is kind of neat i like the way the hammer looks you can see that a little ballast all all over it but um that's kind of a neat hammer you can see the uh, firing pin is on the on the hammer itself and they polish the uh, sides on it See, I got me thinking about 1911 so much. But anyway, so you can, has a little play in it that's supposed to be there. But you can see where the use is. I, it's worn on the edges there where I've shot it a bunch. And then, but the forcing cone is in good shape. It's not cracked or anything. You can see on the inside of it. You can see it. Definitely take it to the range and I'm not shy about putting rounds through it so but figure bring it out show it to you folks one more time there you go Colt Diamondback